of your candy bars, you're going to rip one in half, and you're going to tell me which layer represents the Athenosphere. They're like, Miss, like, only people from the north side go to college. I'm like, no. These kind of conversations are not unusual in Sharon Wezar's classroom. Real life lessons these 12 and 13 year old kids face every day. You need help? Weezar remembers how she was once that kid. I use that like to help them, like where like, oh, well, I'm from the south side. It doesn't matter. Look at me like my parents didn't have a lot of money, but I still went to college. To understand how she made it here, you have to go back to Weezar's childhood. Like my parents always wanted us to have careers that we were going to be financially well, where we weren't going to have to work two jobs. And they just pushed and pushed and pushed until it happened. The first person in my family to graduate from college. And with a biology degree from St. Mary's University, she went on to become a chemist. So I worked at two different pharmaceutical labs in San Antonio. Ironically, the chemistry just wasn't there. Mm -hmm. Instead, she found all the right elements here at Zamora Middle School. We don't know how, but she always makes it really fun. Yeah. When we learn about photosynthesis, it's so easy to learn. We'll go outside and we'll look at leaves. Like I try and like, hey, you can see this when you go home. When she's home, off duty, Huizar likes to craft wonderful stuff like this. You know, for teachers who can relate and she sells them online. Well, I found these at Target and then I added like this to it. My coworkers are like a second family. We were reminiscing like, oh, Bonanza's is such a good restaurant. And then we Googled which was the closest one and it happened to be in Tupelo, Mississippi. So we planned a road trip in the summer and we went to eat there. <laughs> crazy, I know, but teachers are kind of crazy. <laughs> Call it what you want. These kids are learning crucial life lessons. That's how I give back. I might not financially be able to give back, but I can show them like, hey, there's just because your parents don't have money doesn't mean you can't go to college. Values Huizar once learned from her father. He passed away six years ago to cancer, so I know that he's looking down right now, like super proud of this moment. <laughs> um, he knew that this is what I wanted to do, and this makes me happy. I can't imagine doing anything else. Which is labeled the layers of the earth. Your tools experts should have their notes so you can complete that information. And then you're going to use one.